it just right now. This is really good. My name is Salma Ahmed and I am a creative. Huh? It's just basically coming up with ideas, everything from concepting an idea to actually making it come to life. I come from Croydon and I had no idea what advertising was. If you'd asked me, I would have been like, I literally have no idea, something on TV. And I didn't realise it was such a big industry and it was so closed. And it's quite difficult for people like me or you to get into this kind of industry because we're people of colour, I'm a woman. It's, it, it's difficult. There was just no chance of ever being introduced to it, I don't think. I randomly bumped into a girl um, who was a friend of a friend and she was like, have you ever thought of advertising? I was like, what is that? like?" what kind of, so I googled and the IPA came up and I was like, okay, interesting. And then they had this scheme going and it was over the course of a summer. I was placed in agency as an intern creative. I sat down with the creative director at the time and he was like, look, I think you could do this if you wanted to, but I think you should go to ad school. The idea of ad school to me was quite scary because you'd be in a class of 20 and you're all learning the exact same things and doing it in exactly the same way. <laughs> So I was like, Tim, I don't really want to go to ad school. And he was like, I don't really think there's a chance for you, like if you don't go to ad school. I don't know, so I lit a fire under me and I was like, I'm gonna do this. The next two years I did placements, which was long and really difficult, really interesting. Every single person that I spoke to, I learned something from. So at the end of the two years, I ended up at an agency called Sunshine. It was amazing because um, after six months I was hired. I was there for two years and now I've moved and now I'm at a new agency, which is really exciting. Talk to people Hello. and don't be scared and don't be intimidated by anyone. Be determined and don't be put off by the fact that you don't know exactly what it is you want to do. I think the more people you talk to and the more you start realising that people respect you for who you are, the more you'll get self-confidence and that is what will be attractive to people who want to work with you.